favorite part. You're not ready for this geniusness. Ooh. You gotta be a music major to come up with those lyrics. If you ever listen to Daft Punk, me personally, I have a little bit. I've never been really into it, but recently Daft Punk has broken up or more or less retired at the age of like 40 something, nearly 50. Definitely have been around for a long time. And I do think they have created a lot of music um, that was very different. Definitely when they came out too in like 19... 92 and made the first album 1997 definitely made a lot different music today We're gonna be looking at the top 10 songs from Daft Punk according to the billboard I can only remember like one or two songs at max But let's see if I know as a metalhead know them and expand a little bit of my knowledge Robot rock. Throughout their time they basically focused on I think their first album uh, they were just normal guys. Uh, if they are ever shown in interviews, they were just without their helmets. But after working on their second album, and I think their album set on, I mean, not their album, their studio set on fire or everything got deleted. Yeah, I think everything got deleted. They decided to put a persona on their music to make it futuristic. And I think they did a good job of it. I, I don't know too much about them, but the more that goes on, the more I kind of appreciate it because it's different. It's It's not dubstep, but it is definitely did change the sound of EDM and electronic music. They they were looking forward and be like, let's make futuristic music now. Hey, I gotta tell you something, okay? I gotta tell you something really important, okay? If you like this video and subscribe, you'll get a Tesla. It's, it's, just, it's just parked outside your house immediately as soon as you like it, subscribe. And you have to comment too. You have to, you have to do all those things, okay? Trust me, this is not a scam. A Tesla is gonna appear outside your house if you like and subscribe and comment on this video. I would never lie to you guys. I would never lie to you. Just just press like and subscribe in this video, okay? Okay, quick, erase it, write it, get it, paste it, save it, Yo, this load is it, creepy. check it, quick, rewrite it, like it, play it, burn it, rip it, drag it, drop it, zip, unzip it, like Shit. it, feel it, throw it, find it, view it, code it, jump and look it, lock. surf it, scroll it, <laughs> He's spitting flames. Mm, I don't like that. Ooh. Okay. I think I've heard this before. This is kind of iconic. Wow, this is creepy. Oh my god, there's my boy. There he is! There's my favorite white boy! I'm not, I'm not gonna like save it into a playlist but it's definitely enjoyable enough to where I could listen to it and not be like, yo, this sucks. I have definitely heard a lot of metalheads be like, good, they broke up, they suck. Oh, Bro, shut up. I don't care. This is Daft Punk. It's so, every song from them is just so different. Not like if I heard every single song in there, it's like, okay, I think three of those were Daft Punk, a couple of those were, I don't know, some other bands. No, it's all the same. It's so different. Yeah, this is crazy. It is definitely different though. I, I wouldn't say that one is too much of my favorite, but it's, it's interesting. It's like the same anime series. Is this like even a real anime or is this just made specifically for the videos? I think it's that. Uh, it's so funky, it gives you a groove. Sounds like Eruption. In Van Halen. Is this a synth or a guitar? I can't tell. It cuts off though, so I think it's a synth. Yeah, this is very much a Russian kind. This is kind of cool. So it has like solos in it too. I don't know what's going on. Ooh. Okay, that's cool. And all over that. That's pretty cool. I respect that one. That one's actually really cool. This one's called Defunk. Mmm. Jasmine's just be like, 
I love the 440 hats on this. I go in a rave and I hear this, so I'd be like, what up, girl? It's, it's like skater park, futuristic skater park music. I mean, it makes sense. What's happening? I mean, I swear most of the music is just all so... None of it sounds the same, almost. Like, it's all so different. And that's what's hard as a musician, or even a band, to have the same, or complete different sound from almost every single song. Okay, this one's iconic. Don't copyright me. But this one's iconic. Come on. If you don't know this, you're, you're retarded. Remember when Tobuscus? made a parody of this song. That's when life was good. I think this is their number one song of like all time, like at least for like sales. Oh, I haven't heard this part, yeah. That's cool. That's cool. It's like funk, but also has a really strong groove to it and techno technology. <laughs> what are you doing, step bro? This almost sounds like it's Ev Sheeran went like, like lo-fi. This is crazy. This is Daft Punk. Wow. <laughs> Every time I go, it just gets crazier and crazier. Now, I know this one, because I heard about their breakup, I checked out this song, it's kind of cool. It is definitely slightly repetitive, but just groove, just groove to it. My favorite part, you're not ready for this geniusness. You gotta be a music major to come up with those lyrics. It is slightly repetitive, yes, but it is definitely different for its time, and it is definitely very creative, in a way. If you don't know this, you're actually retarded. Okay. Everyone knows this. Let's bring these back to my Osu days. I played Osu a lot. Yeah, it's been a while since I heard this, but it's definitely enjoyable to listen back to. It's kind of nostalgic. A lot of the songs are nostalgic. Oh. Number one song of all time probably from them is just Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger. I mean, it's so iconic. I don't know why it's not number one, it's number two. We'll see what number one is. Wow. I think I remember this. Has nostalgia for some reason. Yeah, this one's weird. I I'm just gonna say that. Metalhead elitist would be like, The shirts are Okay, maybe there is a, just a little bit too much auto too. Yeah, if I, if I went to a party and I heard this, I'd be like, Alright, it's kinda cool. It's one of those songs that you only like, you only get into if you're like at a party in a big event and you hear this. Overall, my opinions on Daft Punk, I think they are a great band. Obviously, it's just two people, but I think after 30 years, about, maybe, they split up. I don't even think they split up. I think they just retired. They're just like, yeah, we retire. Um, I definitely do think they're an interesting band, very different. Um, I think they made only four or five albums total though. That's crazy for like almost 30 years. You think they make more. I'm not crush crushing them. I'm just saying like 
you could have made more. And I wish they would have because, you know, some of the songs I enjoy, some of them, like the last one we just heard, it's just a little, little bit up there. No, I enjoy them though. I like it. Um, it's different. We need more different music because all the music sounds the same today. Even if it's crazy, even if it doesn't sound good to the masses, that doesn't mean you still shouldn't do it. I do enjoy it, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you later, guys, in the next video. Peace out.